Okay, everything has been installed. We started with the base installation from tutorial on Arch.pe. Then we installed Arch, uh, sorry, uh, Arch Mate. Well, it, this Arch, and we installed Mate on it. So this is the standard Mate. No, not really. We installed a lot of stuff already from the GitHub from Eric Dubois. There's this Arch Mate. A lot of scripts that we ran from here till 700. Those we ran already and a lot of stuff has been installed. Let's now make our system beautiful. So to our liking. So a lot of software that's uh, extra, like the variety, let's do that. I'm tired of looking at this wallpaper and I say, no, thank you, no, thank you. And then you can set all kinds of things. Do check it out. There is a tutorial of uh, on Eric Dubois on the variety tips, many tips. And the thing is, when you scroll over this icon, you can get a different, I like this one, a different wallpaper. Okay, so wallpapers has been covered. What's next? Look and feel, appearance. We have this Art Dark installed. A lot of Art Darks, it seems. There is a GitHub uh, which explains to you that you have 16 million colors. And rather than having the standard Arc Dark, you can have also an Arc Dark Red and Orange and Yellow, 60 million colors. You decide the color, you put it in the script, you run the scripts and you have your own Arc Colora uh, theme. So that's what we did. So these are all tests uh, with the Arc Dark, Takao and so on. I'm going to keep just the uh, Arc Dark for now. The backgrounds, it takes a while to load, but these are the standard uh, backgrounds. You see, we have selected this one. It's not coming from um, Variety. When in virtual box, there is no communication with the outside world. We keep in here. We can set our, f our fonts. Uh, we can say it's a bit small. In my case, often you will see me change the fonts. I do need glasses to see and read, so I do this. And you can go for bold italic on titles, why not? And here you are. So, nothing to show here. So we have changed already some things. So customize, our dark colors, keep off of these. You will change a color, but not everywhere. So rather stay away from it and I want an, an, another icon as well so these are the Sardi icons you can see them maybe when we open a folder so these are based on the arc from github from uh, horse 3180 and they have now been part of uh, Sardi so we have an easy way to just go over all these icons and uh, when you see an icon you like you can wait for it and say okay it's gonna be this one that we're going to show and so on so lots of icons and a pointer don't forget this one i like to breathe snow close let's put it here yeah okay close so this is our look now icons have been changed everywhere it's now one color which is the project of uh, takao and the uh, uh, complete desktop theming projects on Eric Dubois and including the, co the coloring of the Sardi icons, including the theme, including the, the, uh, the desktop with uh, these icons here. Everything has been tuned, has been changed. Let's clean our trash and it looks differently. So these have been changed. Anything else? Sure, sure. We can do more stuff. We can go inside here and look and feel. Appearance is one thing. Mate week is another. We've installed that, so what is it? You don't want to have a computer or a home or trash or mounted volumes on it. But you do want to right mouse click and work on your uh, desktop. Well, because if you do this, there is no right mouse click and your desktop will be clean. Yeah. So I do want to work uh, and put th stuff there interface you can do that like so and a lot of gnome things all kind of things you can do before you change anything before you do maybe it's a good thing to say save the panel layout 
So this is the standard layout. This has been called Eric Tweak. And we can now always refer back to it. So when something does not look right, we know how it looked in the beginning. So now we're on Netbook. Redmond going down here. You know what happens in Redmond. That's why it's called like that. Mm -hmm. All right. So this is all possibilities, all, all kind of, uh, I'm gonna keep the Eric tweak again. And then um, Windows. And we have Marco as window manager in Mate, but you can choose also Compass as uh, manager or, or Metacity or anything of those. So question of, of just installing it. I've made a tutorial on YouTube as well about that, just to show how that will look. But uh, this is made and we could install Plank as well or, or Conky. So these things have been installed already. It's here in access accessories, Plank. And here's your Plank. Of course, it's not the right place. So with the control and then right mouse click, we get here this bottom. Let's do it to the left, for instance, and make it a lot smaller since, oh, not, not like that, but like that. So we have an, uh, a proportional look like so. And we could install a Conky and a Conky is installed. It's hidden in the Aureola folder. When we copied the number 600, that's what we did. Eh? We copied bookmarks. These are not the standard bookmarks. So I have my direct shortcut to a hidden folder, Aureola. I'm gonna run the Acres. I'm gonna say, open in terminal and install me something. First off, I do not like this terminal. I'm gonna fix that. Okay, use a conky, of course, our screen is too, too small, so it will not show everything. But like I said, we have another thing to do. Open the terminal, profiles, nope. Open terminal, profile preferences, don't show the menu, make it bigger for you guys to see it. And then, for me to see it. Colors, blah, 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 background. This is the one I want. I want to have transparency. Wondering if it will work in this case. I don't think so. Maybe we're missing something in this virtual machine. Anyway, it will work on an SSD and then disabled. Don't want that. Unlimited. Yes, thank you. And here we are. So next time I open up my terminal, it look a bit different already. And I was gonna show you guys patch. What is? So we're actually um, if we start with an ISO of February, we get this kernel of 4.9.8. We're at Bash, we're made with Metacity or Marco, and with an Arc Dark, sadly flexible Takao. So he reads everything correctly. The only thing for me to try again is maybe losing a time that's making my, <laughs> my virtual box the correct size, it is a better size. Not gonna try it. Um, maybe I'll try it later, and, but put it on pause before I do. Um, anything else? Yeah, you could install the compass, for instance. That's something you could do as an, uh, a challenge, and that is a challenge. And what else? I think we're pretty much set. The only thing left is to check out my folder for ArchMate and see what software you would like to install. And there's Roblox, uh, stuff like that. Google Earth is not, it's not for everybody. You want some music, G Radio. You want to uh, make USB from an ISO to an USB. I use this one always. It's coming from Linux Mint. It has worked, has served me every time, it worked every time. So I'm keeping it around on any uh, distro. Skype, Slack, Spotify, 
Now there was an issue with Spotify at the time, so just wait a day and it will work probably. Vivaldi is a better browser. I think the better, the best one at this point in time. So check out scripts, check out programs and install or do not install them. It's up to you. And I would say enjoy Arch and enjoy um, Mate and uh, have fun.